another Oradaki surprise. So, let's have a look and see what I managed to get my paws on. This time, I've been quite excited about this one. So this time we have Bail Fix. I have been so looking forward to doing this. It looks so much fun. It is kind of a blind bag as well because you don't know which style of clothes she's gonna get and her makeup changes as well. But I have been so looking forward to this. Um, I picked out all of them, um, Kawaii Cutie, because I thought she was super cute. She's kind of got the same hair color as me and I'm massively into Kawaii kind of culture. So let's go ahead and get this open. So we flip the camera around. Um, and as I said, I'm super excited about this one. Oh, excited. So let's get her open. She's so cute. Okay, so I do have my trusty scissors with me. But as far as I can see. Okay. Oh, yay! Another doll with a stand. Love dolls with stands. Fab. Okay. So now I've got all the excess packaging off. As you can see, we get a stand, a comb, two little pom poms which have got flocking on them. So nice and fuzzy. We have some bands to sort hair out, a face mask whatever her outfit is underneath here and then obviously all her other accessories are stuck in her hair so the looks of it there aren't any other instructions on kind of how to do her hair or anything like that apart from this little one here that says you put the pom-poms in her hair so let's get everything out and laid out and then we can go from there And then our girl, I have a feeling once I take this off, I'm gonna know which outfit she has. So happy you got the kitty cat dress. Okay, let's get her out. Get her out and move all the packaging out of the way. Oh my god, I got the kitty cat dress. Ooh, she's stuck to the side. Get all the little bits of plastic out of the way. There we go. Okay. So, wait. Okay. So. There's a little face mask that we put on her to get rid of her bad makeup. Okay, her fringe is quite stiff. So hopefully we can get this underneath and apparently it clips on. Behind her ears, there we go, clip it behind her ears. And then if you pull, 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 pull. There we go. <gasps> oh my God, that is amazing so her eyes are really pretty um, she's got little stars in the middle of them and we've got some really nice holographic glitter she's got like drips hanging down and then all these little tiny stars and some really nice iridescent lip gloss her arms are completely poseable um, all the joints and hands are too 
Does she have a waist that moves? She doesn't have a waist that moves, but her legs again are jointed. So her legs can move in all directions. But she is such a cute little doll as well. She's not overly big. So yeah, let's let's sort this girl out. Let's we've done a makeup. We found out that she's wearing the cutest dress in the world. Let's get her hair sorted. So in here I can see some earrings or oh, or a necklace I should I say so one necklace in a hair and then I think this is an earring yep one earring and then oh, underneath this clip there's another earring and then we've got three clips which I will take out of her hair for now oh. Two stars, one's yellow, one's blue, and a pink heart. Okay. And bless her, we have two shoes. So one and two. And then we have this mess of a locks <laughs> going on. So let's put her shoes on. So she's got one shoe, which just goes on really nice and easy. And then shoe number two, again, that goes on really nice and easily. And they are super cute. So let me see if it says on the back of the box. Can't go to the box. Does it have any instructions on how we brush this girl's hair out? No, it just says brush her hair out, put the pom-poms in, and then we can arrange everything as we like. Okay, so let's start brushing out. This is actually really, really solid. This is really solid. So let's see with this. Start brushing. This might take me a while. Ooh. just starting from the bottom and working our way up so bear with me while I do this so there is still quite a bit of glue to get out we're getting there we are getting there and um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna brush just the top bit a little tiny bit more just to get a bit more of that glue out and hopefully make it go a little tiny bit flatter because at the moment She's a bit fly away. She's a little bit 80s at the moment. So yeah, we'll just need to just get some more of this out and hopefully it will sit a little bit better. So I quickly just paused the video and went and really, 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 really brushed her hair out, um, which has worked quite well. It is still very bouncy. And the other thing I found out is it's like she hasn't got as much hair at the back. So she's quite bald at the back of her head there, which is a little tiny bit of a shame, but I've managed to brush it so it's kind of not as fly away. So hopefully, once we get her hair sorted as to how it's supposed to look, it won't be too bad. I also need to like find one of the stars because it pinged off as I was brushing her hair. So I have unfortunately lost a star somewhere on my floor. So hopefully I will find it again later. Uh, for one of my cats finds it would be appropriate but so it's a bit of a shame that I've lost that I'm going to bring the camera in a bit so then we can see her a little bit closer up just where I do her hair so let me see how her hair is supposed to be we brush it out and then I think she's supposed to have two bits of hair at the back so we pull Pull some bits to the back. About that much. I'm terrible at doing my own hair, let alone someone else's hair. Okay. 
it at me. Oh, by these in. I will come here. This is so fit. This is gonna be so fiddly for me. to be about that much. Maybe the other side I need to sort out. Mm. Oh my god, this is the most awkward bit. Okay, then we're just going to put the other little one in. Whee! hair. Oh my god, half a hair has come with me. I need clips for this girl's hair to sort this out. And then that bit, and then Oh my god. You can tell I'm not a proper girly girl. I can't even do this with a doll. And I've nearly lost a pop-up. Right. I will do this better later. I'm just doing this for kind of, yeah. And then earring number one. Earring number two. Oh, they're super cute, these earrings as well. There we go. So they're like a little heart and then a star and then a heart. So they are super cute. And then her necklace, I think, is about the same way. It's got a little butterfly and some stars on it. And that goes around her there. And then we've got little clips to go in her hair. This is quite easy to put in. Yep. Take them out for now. As I'm hopefully going to find that other one that I've lost on the floor somewhere. And then her little pom poms, which will go into her hair just at the top to make her look like what she's supposed to. Oops. It's not a very good kind of, if I had a bit more time to sit and do this, I'd probably be able to do a better job of it. She still looks really pretty. So yeah. I love the idea, I love the concept, I love the hair. The only thing is the hair is still quite fly away. It's gonna take a while to kind of calm down where it's been stuck in the glue. But she is so adorable. I said I love the size. She's quite compact. Instead of like some other dolls, not much of her hair's fallen out from where I brushed it. Only little tiny bits. There is kind of a bald patch problem at the back of her hair here, which is a little bit concerning. But apart from that, everything's kind of fitted into her hair really nicely. I like the fact that she's poseable and she comes with a stand, which is brilliant. More dolls need to come with stands. I think I've only done three so far with a stand, so. And also her face, where her face has come off on this, you can put it back on and keep doing that. So this is reusable as well. So all in all, I really like this doll. It's really pretty. Everything that you get with it, you get a really good sort of comb. Yeah, really love this doll. Really love the fact that you can do so much with it. So thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And I will see you on another episode of Aura Doggy Surprise. Bye.